Welcome to the CTB News Channel. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the hottest news of the day. Our newsletter today includes the following. After Amber Heard and Johnny Depp trial, online users follow Marilyn Manson and Evan Rachel Wood defamation lawsuit. Another defamation suit is in progress. After the Johnny Depp and Amber Heard trial concluded, there was a renewed interest in celebrity litigation. If you've been keeping score at home, you'll know that Marilyn Manson has filed yet another defamation suit against his ex-girlfriend, Evan Rachel Wood, for falsely accusing him of abusing her years after she testified before a judicial committee about being a victim of violence. After the revelation of the 6,000-page, unsealed document in the Depp case, which also brought Manson to the forefront, there appears to be a tendency among online social media users toward monitoring the occurrences of this new litigation. When the trial between Amber Heard and Johnny Depp took place, it attracted a lot of attention. After the verdict was announced, Depp saw that his TikTok audience had become so invested in the trial that he made a special video to express his gratitude. TikTok and other platforms have seen a surge in views for in-depth analyses of the Manson Wood case. According to an article published by Insider, a number of Twitter and YouTube accounts that acquired popularity due to their coverage of the Heard and Depp trial are now shifting their focus to Marilyn Manson because of the success they saw during the trial. That news source also recently interviewed Rachel Jevlin, a professor at Birmingham Southern College in the United Kingdom, who predicted that if Marilyn Manson and Evan Rachel Wood's case went to trial, a similar outcome may be expected. In what way does she justify this? Readers' fascination in the private lives of the affluent and famous dates back centuries. That Marilyn Manson and Johnny Depp are acquainted, and that the singer's name was mentioned in the other case both lend credence to this theory. Although Manson never testified, newly released documents reveal that Johnny Depp's text, conversations to him had a part in the case. Depp was questioned in court about his friendship with Manson, revealing that the two had done drugs together. Similar viewers to those who followed the Depp Heard trial could be interested in this one as well. A petition has been started to ban Evan Rachel Wood from social media, similar to how Amber Heard was trolled before, during, and after her court battle with her ex. However, while the petition has already received over a thousand signatures, this number pales in comparison to the petitions about Amber Heard. Over 4.6 million people have signed a petition demanding that Amber Heard be cut from the upcoming Aquaman sequel. When speaking to NGYR separately, Mitu attorney Lee Feldman said that the case against Manson may go either way depending on the nature of the claims and the public's perception of the musician in question. A different outcome is likely in the Marilyn Manson case, in my opinion. Johnny Depp is not Marilyn Manson. One could even say that Johnny Depp is loved by some of his fans. His films made billions of dollars, and he has countless devoted followers. A small yet dedicated group of people call themselves Marilyn Manson fans. There isn't the same level of public enthusiasm for him as there is for, say, Johnny Depp. Despite Marilyn Manson's denials of the allegations made by Evan Rachel Wood and others, he has lost career opportunities as a result of the scandal. After losing a role in the star series American Gods, which was part of his semi-regular acting career, his former record label pulled his material off its website. Meanwhile, the musician hasn't avoided sparking debate 